kicks off the new year, we're showing off some new security upgrades on campus. WAFB's Elise Corville gives us a look. As students come back on campus, something new continues to pop up. A three-phase lighting program. Phase one is complete. Phase two will be complete in November. And then phase three, which is really just getting started, will be completed next spring. With the lights also came some new security cameras. There are now over 1700 cameras on campus and they have been upgraded with newer technology and enhanced capabilities. You want to make sure that we're putting them in areas that they're going to serve a purpose. Uh, they also serve as a deterrent for crime. So them being visible in, in highly trafficked areas is a key component to that. Surveillance from the real time cameras will feed into here. Safety is a priority and we do everything we can to communicate with our parents to let them know that that is always at the forefront. This is the newly reconstructed Office of Emergency Preparedness. The office is designed for all hazards pertaining to campus safety with operations in line with national standards and best practices in place. And we're pretty much set up the same way as local and state governments. We also instituted what we call WebEOC, which is our emergency management platform. That platform allows to be tied directly into the local and state government when it comes to major catastrophic events that affect the entire state. Elise Corville for WAFB 9 News. All right, Elise, thank you. Five